WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman on this Thursday, the 18th of July. We're looking at the Dow uh, now down three points at uh, 41,194. It actually screamed all the way to the 41,376 level. And so it's about 200 points off that right now. But there is a potential for a little doji candle and a pullback tomorrow. We'll see what happens. The weekly close is going to be so important with this cup formation. We've had a one-to-one almost a one-to-one -to, -one to the upside. It has to go a little bit more. Actually, I drew that in right here. I'll do a little bit more of that when I come back to do Steve's hour because Steve, I believe, is, uh, just uh, said that he's not feeling well at all. So, Steve, get better. So, 41,390 is my one-to-one -one that I'm looking at for the upside. It got really close today. I'm uh, going to the 41. 376 uh, missed it by 14 points so i think that we're very close to that and we can have a little bit of a timeout we'll see what happens looking at the s p sbx there we go s p right now is trading right bumping right up it did a uh, bump into that inside track repellent zone so it's pulling back it's down one at 5587 it's kind of struggling here the nine is still over the 14 it's got a long way oh i didn't even show that i'll do that in the next hour the 914s how they working how the semiconductor might finally go negative but look at this s p up against the inside track repellent zone pulling back qqq did the same thing in the daily chart it went right up to that resistance line at 503.52 now it's down at 481 i suspect that it's going to go to the 479s uh, by um, early next week, we're looking at the IWM coming back a little bit from making a, a higher, whoops, a higher high yesterday to a recovery high at 226.64. Uh, it's down off the off the high. It's up 34, 222.62. I think it could pull back a little bit more. But then I think this buying is going to come in. We're looking at this uh, a scan saying, well, what's happening next? SMH has really took a dive yesterday, and today it's following through to the downside. It is up 83 at 255.05, but it did make a lower low, and it took out the, the 255.66 low that was really a target for the downside. Uh, it did it today. Looking at gold, uh, let me see. Gold right now is trading up 11, holding very nicely. Uh, all the technicals are still strong. Watching that weekly for tomorrow's close. Looking at the dollar, I didn't do the dollar before when I did my show. Um, the dollar is up a little bit off, trying to get back above the 100 and into the 104s but we'll see what happens there and the bonds bonds were down earlier on and now they're down oh, about a half a point they're not failing but they really need to see the the, the bonds go higher so yields come down i'll be doing steve Rhodes show coming up in the next hour check out my opening call on my daily newsletter and my webinar coming up on tuesday sectors to look at and stock